Hi guys, this is Jude from EasyTex. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you one more way to fix blue screen error in Windows 11 and Windows 10 computers. I've made a number of videos showing different ways to troubleshoot blue screen errors. Obviously, there are several possible causes of blue screens ranging from hardware to software related issues. So if the solution in this video doesn't fix your blue screen, you can check out the other related videos I've made on this issue. I'll leave their links down in the video description. And now without further ado, let's jump right into it. Okay, so for this laptop, I've been having occasional blue screens every now and then. I really didn't take much notice until recently when I noticed that the blue screen happens each time I got a video call or try to sign into any video applications like Teams, Google Meet or WhatsApp. It pops up with a system service exception stop code and the failed service is this SPUVC BV64.sys, which is the camera driver. So from here, I already have an idea of the cause of this blue screen. Now, even if you get a different stop code or a different failed service, once this blue screen keeps occurring when you launch your camera or launch an application that interacts with your camera, I will still recommend the fix I'll be demonstrating here. If that doesn't solve it for you, then you can try the other suggested videos in the video description. Okay, so to fix this issue, go to your search and type device manager. Click on device manager from the search results. On the device manager, look for imaging devices and click on the arrow next to it to expand the options. Here where it says integrated camera, right click on it and select update driver. And then on this pop-up, click on browse my computer for drivers. Then here click on let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Here select USB video device and hit next. Now it should install pretty quickly. Then close the pop-up. Now here you will notice that you no longer have integrated camera on the imaging devices. Instead you now have it on the cameras. Now close the device manager and try to run your camera or video applications once again. And here as you can see, the camera now runs fine with no more blue screens. When I check my meets or teams, also works fine with no more blue screens again this is just one of the many possible causes of blue screen on windows you can also experience a similar issue from the graphics card drivers in which case you will need to uninstall the default driver and visit the manufacturer support site to download the most recent or updated drivers generally it helps if you observe the event that usually leads to the blue screen and also check the error stop code as well as the failed services this information could help guide you towards pinpointing the actual cause of the blue screen that way you don't have to try too many unrelated fixes and that is it for this tutorial hope this was able to help you out give this video a thumbs up if you found it useful and share with anyone you think might want to see drop us a comment if you have any questions or feedbacks don't forget to subscribe and turn on notification for updates on future tech support videos like this one thanks for watching and see you in the next one